Hi, I'm Sol and I'm part of the team here at MyWorks. In this video, I'll be showing you how our WooCommerce Sync for QuickBooks Online syncs all of your data from WooCommerce to QuickBooks. Our solution syncs all of your orders, payments, customers, products, including variations, your inventory, and more across both platforms. Among the features that make us stand out from other solutions are real-time and two-way sync functionalities. This means that you can sync both platforms in real time, from WooCommerce to QuickBooks and QuickBooks to WooCommerce. This ensures that both platforms are completely in sync at all times and makes otherwise complicated activities like inventory management a piece of cake. Although we have the most robust syncing features, we also know that not every business is the same, and each store has different needs. For this reason, our sync settings allow you to determine exactly what type of data syncs, when it syncs, and how it syncs. These are all things that I'll be showing you in this video. First, I'll give you a quick overview of what the integration looks like and where it's managed. So to set the integration up, you would just upload it right to your plugins page as you would with any other WordPress plugin. It's quite easy. And then once it's activated, you'll see it pop up right here in your sidebar. Yes, this means that the integration is managed from within your site. No external dashboards needed. It's great. And all of your settings are handled here too. They're already preset to default, so if you have a simple store, you can leave most of these as is. But if you have a complex store, you can perfectly customize the integration settings to meet your needs. We have documentation and separate videos on these as well. Now let's talk about syncing. As I mentioned earlier, the syncing happens automatically. But you can choose between real-time sync or queue sync. It's completely up to you. And after you finish setup, real-time sync is always the default. To choose between real-time sync or queue sync, you'd go right here to your dashboard, which you can reach from your sidebar. You just click dashboard. And this is where you can toggle between real-time or queue sync settings. Real-time sync will sync data over to QuickBooks Online the very instant it's created or updated in WooCommerce. Whereas QSync will compile these syncing activities in a queue in our dashboard which will then be synced over to QuickBooks Online every 10, 30, or 60 minutes. So here's where we can toggle between them. Typically, real-time sync works best for our users. Some users that have their WooCommerce store on a cheaper or lower resource hosting plan will see performance decline when using our real-time sync. And this is when we'd recommend their QSync because it doesn't have much of a resource requirement on your store. So now that you've chosen your syncing method, We'll visit the automatic sync settings to configure what type of data will sync. To get to your settings, we'll click here on settings in the sidebar, and then we'll go to our automatic sync settings. And this is where there's a master switch for the WooCommerce to QuickBooks sync, as well as one for the QuickBooks to WooCommerce sync. Regardless of whether you're using real-time sync or queue sync, this tab is where you control the settings for what data gets synced automatically. You can turn the entire sync on or off, right here. Then select the data types to enable or disable. These are each super easy to turn on or off. Don't want to sync inventory? Easy! Just switch it off. As you can see, you're in full control. When syncing is enabled, syncing activity is built up in our queue and automatically synced in the background to QuickBooks Online every 10, 30, or 60 minutes. It depends on what you set it to. So right here you can select your queue interval. Whether you use real-time sync or queue sync, you still have complete control over the data types that you sync. So now that we've covered automatic sync, which will automatically sync all new data activity that occurs in WooCommerce after our integration is activated, let's talk a bit about our manual sync, which applies to existing or historic data in WooCommerce. If you have existing data in QuickBooks or WooCommerce, you're going to be happy to hear that our integration also allows you to push any past data over to QuickBooks Online with just the click of a button. Whether you're behind on your QuickBooks accounting or you haven't brought new products in from the one platform to the other, you can easily push any data types over to QuickBooks, as well as pull any data from QuickBooks into WooCommerce. All you have to do is visit the push page, which is right here on your sidebar once again. From here, you would select the data type that you'd like to push. So we have customer, order, product, variation, inventories, and payment. As you can see here, there's easy checkboxes that you tick 
to push something over and voila, it'll be pushed right over to QuickBooks. And as you can see, we have a sync status indicator on the right that will tell you what data has already been transferred to QuickBooks. And that's an overview of how syncing works with the MyWork software WooCommerce Sync for QuickBooks Online. Our integration has many other settings that you can take advantage of, including what accounts data is matched to, whether you sync orders as invoices or as sale receipts, and much, much more. So be sure to check out our documentation or reach out if you have any questions at all. Thanks for watching.